guys it's snowing outside it was a beautiful day yesterday sunny and 67 degrees and today snowing well, the beautifying project of the RV consists of some wallpapers to go specifically in the uh, bedroom area and the uh, dinette area so that's uh, something that I'm gonna try and achieve hopefully I <laughs> I do it right, I've never done it before, so wish me luck. Alright guys, so as I said, the beautifying project of the RV and also you know, in one of the Facebook groups that I am a member of that is specifically about the um, Winnebago Trend or Itasca Viva, uh, a fellow member over there came up with an amazing solution on how to have these front cabinet doors to stay up when you open them because there's nothing in there, there's no hinges, there's no nothing. So she came up with this idea of these springs, tension springs, and then they're eight, eight and a quarter size long. I got them from Amazon, I'll put the link below. And all you have to do is basically attach it here to the side. So when you open it, it stays up. All you have to do is bend the spring and it closes down. So that's a genius uh, and quick, easy uh, fix. It's only $9 for these two springs, came from Amazon. So I'm gonna install that too. And not to mention that I'm actually in complete boondock situation here. And I'm not using my battery, the house battery, at all. Instead, I'm using the EcoFlow Delta that I've already done a video about that uh, previously. You can watch that video right here. So click on that and then uh, you can watch how I do it. In that video, however, I forgot to mention something. When I connect the EcoFlow Delta into the system, basically what I'm doing is I'm uh, in the fuse box, there's a switch for the converter. You just have to turn that off and the existing wiring in the house, in the cabin, in the RV, powered up by the EcoFlow. And literally, like, I'm using all the lights, the heat right now, and it's not even drawing anything. Like, it's nothing. You can stay with the EcoFlow Delta without the converter being on you can run this RV for days without having to recharge the EcoFlow Delta. So that's something that I forgot to mention in my previous video. So here it is, the EcoFlow Delta, and it's def definitely drawing zero. Like output is zero watts. It's 100% charged, and it's gonna give me 99 hours until it's completely depleted. And again, I am connecting uh, the RV to it with a 15 volt converter right there. And that runs through the window crack. That's it. I'm trying to wallpaper either the headboard wall and maybe in addition the side wall right here or the wall by the window. So, hmm. We'll see, not sure. So tag along and we'll get going. So I have two rolls, two different shades, two different colors that will definitely uh, match this uh, uh, paint scheme here or the general scheme here. And then I'm gonna start doing that. So why don't you come along and see how I do it? Wish me luck. <laughs> Yeah. 
Okay, so this is going to be the final piece of the headboard. I think it's uh, it looking definitely good, but um, <laughs> it's my first time, so it takes a little while, you know? Um, let me show you. That looks okay, I mean, and this is like two pieces, so the continuity, I think I nailed it. <laughs> um, so now I have this little piece that will have to go up here and then the headboard will be complete. So, um, well, stick around. I'll show you the finished product in a few minutes. All right, just finished. Um, obviously, I guess when I do this wall, it would look much better um, but overall I'm very happy with the uh, uh, product <laughs> I guess the finish uh, looks is okay at least it adds some uh, brightness to the uh, headboard and now we can actually hang some pictures and stuff like that and uh, make it more homey and cozy I don't know for a first timer I think it's a good job <laughs> All right, let me know what you think in the comments. Yeah, so thank you for watching. Um, I'm overall happy with the result. I'm probably going to continue with a few more walls and I have a different color, a different pattern as well. So add more color and uh, variety in this uh, cabin and make it more warmer and cozier. So. Uh, I'm sure you will uh, see more pictures on our Instagram account. Don't forget to follow. The link is down below. And uh, please do give us a like and please do comment because comments are very important for me. Um, all your thoughts, all your questions are, I definitely read everything and I reply to all your comments. So, and if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please do so, uh, so that this video can reach to uh, other viewers like yourself who are interested and passionate about RV life. So once again, thank you for watching and see you on the road.